Today's mobility drill and warm up is going to be a posterior and anterior pelvic tilt. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Basically, you're just going to be a big booty girl or a flat bottom boy. Big booty girl, flat bottom boy. Big booty girl, flat bottom boy. Big booty, flat bottom, big booty, flat bottom. <laughs> what I'm doing here is I'm using, well, I'm stretching and getting some mobility in the pelvic area. And I'm doing that by anterior tilting the pelvis and then posterior tilt. So that's an anterior tilt where the front of the pelvis tilts down and you stick your butt out. And then when you tuck your butt in, that's a posterior tilt. I'm really just getting, it really helps the lower back, it helps the hips, it just loosens and loosens, is, loosens everything up in that area. And it gets me ready. I like to do this before I do any type of squats, lunges, burpees, Mm, yoga, really any kind of movement. It's just a great exercise to do throughout the day, but today we're specifically doing it for the workout that we're going to do in the next video. So what I like to do here is I like to put my hand about at my navel and then at my lower back and then I just tuck and roll the hips. So posterior and then anterior tilt back and forth. And the reason I put my hand here is it gives me a point of reference to see if I'm moving my upper body as well. I don't want to get a bunch of other stuff going on here. I really just want to make sure that I'm moving the hips and the joints that I want to be moving. Through this range of motion, I don't try to overdo it. I just go through a range that's comfortable for me. And I do anywhere from five to eight reps of that. And then what I also like to do is activate some of the glute muscles. And I do that by getting up on the balls of my feet, alternating. So again, that's getting up on the balls of my feet, alternating. So right foot up, it's activating a glute muscle up here. And then on the left side, again, getting up on the ball of my foot, getting the left glute muscle going. And that's really just loosening everything up here. Now, if I can put it all together, what I'm hopefully going to be able to do is make a circle, right? A whole big old circle motion with my hips, so right? So I'm going to come around here. I'm going to do a tilt and a raise at the same time. Then I'm going to go the other way and do a tilt and a raise at the same time as well. And then just kind of swap them back and forth. I get kind of fancy with it after I've been doing it for a while. But when you're first starting, just go really slow with it. Feel the movement. Just get those hips moving. Feel like a belly dancer, you know, getting things rocking around. And there, that's it. That's my hip mobility exercises and drill. Really what I'm doing here is a posterior and an anterior pelvic tilt. Now this is not a rehab exercise. This is not meant to fix any type of tilt, whether you have a posterior or an anterior pelvic tilt. This is just meant as a mobility exercise for somebody just to get things moving, to get you prepped and ready for an exercise. And there you have it. Again, my name is Drew Smith. This is Under 10 Fitness, where we get you in shape in as little as 10 minutes a day. You can check out more content that we have, including a members area, at under10fitness.com. And as always, remember, stay motivated.